Hey Aman, I read the news of new ways to fight cancer using surface plasmon resonance. Surface plasmons? I have read about it in my electromagnetics course. Great! The news said that surface plasmon resonance based biosensors are used for detection of biomarkers that provide useful biological information about the cancer cells. Okay. Please tell me what is surface plasmon resonance and how can it be used in sensors? Yeah, sure. I'll tell you about surface plasmons. Surface plasmons are coherent delocalized electron oscillations. They exist at the interface between any two materials where the real part of dielectric constant or emittivity changes sign across the interface, such as a metal dielectric interface. There are evanescent waves on both sides of the interface. What are evanescent waves? An evanescent wave is a near field wave with an intensity that exhibits exponential decay without absorption as a function of distance from the boundary at which the wave was formed. So this means that energy is confined in a small area in that wave. Exactly. So there is a decay on both sides of the interface and the wave only propagates in the longitudinal direction. By solving the Maxwell's equation, we find the longitudinal oscillations are quantized which is equal to omega by c under root of epsilon of dielectric multiplied by epsilon of metal upon epsilon of dielectric plus epsilon of metal. Also, the range of frequencies at which we can observe the surface plasmon is between omega p and divided by 1 plus epsilon d under root to omega p, where omega p is the plasma frequency. Are surface plasmons possible at all such interfaces? Good question, yes. You cannot observe surface plasmons from light directly coming from a source because Kx matching is not possible. To observe surface plasmons, you need either this kind of structure where you will observe surface plasmon at second interface. You will observe a dip in intensity at a particular angle at which surface plasmons are excited. This is known as resonance angle. Obviously, this resonance angle depends on permittivity of the dielectric. Can you now tell me how it is used in biosensors? The sensor surface is glass slide coated with gold surface. The molecules attached to the gold surface via dextran matrix which provides a hydrophilic environment for the interaction. Different matrices correspond to specific bindings. One binding partner is attached to the surface of the sensor and the second is injected in a continuous flow of solution. These biosensors use the concept of surface plasmon resonance to detect biochemical interactions as they happen. So there is a reduction in intensity of light at a specific angle due to formation of surface plasmons as I explained you earlier. As molecules bind to the surf sensor surface, refractive index close to the surface changes, which changes the angle of minimum intensity. The change in SPR angle is proportional to mass of material bound. Hence, we can answer all type of questions like binding, specificity, affinity, kinetics and concentration of the molecules. Scientists are working on this property to detect cancer cells. Okay, thank you.